What Should I Do is a video series which educates the viewers on the best way to coexist with wildlife. Whenever in doubt, consult your nearest wildlife rehabilitator. Thank you for calling the Wildlife Center of Silicon Valley. This is Nora. Raccoons are one of the few animals which seem to have benefited from living in close proximity to humans. A raccoon's search for food may lead it to your vegetable garden, garbage can, or backyard. By following these basic steps, you can keep raccoons at bay without hurting the animal. Raccoons are highly attracted to cat and dog food. Keeping food inside will take away the reason for the raccoon to visit your backyard. Raccoons will readily consume fallen fruit if available. If the temptation is eliminated, fewer raccoons will wander into your backyard. Raccoons have long, slender fingers that make it easy to open garbage cans and grasp food. Keeping garbage cans secure with a bungee cord makes it difficult for the raccoon to open the can. Offering food to a wild animal can make them lose their natural fear of people. You want a cookie? Oh, let's have a cookie. Confronting an animal can encourage the animal to act <coughs> Visit us at WCSV.org to find out the best ways to coexist with our wild neighbors.